Hey guys, Ladder for the Support Player here, bringing you a 3 million sticky bomb tactician build. If you like what you see, feel free to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Try to stream at least two to three times a week. Hit that notifications bell to see when I'm live and you can tune in anytime. I'm here to help and I'm here to play. I hope you enjoy the gameplay. What's going on, guys? Today, I'll be talking about my 3 million sticky bomb build. I know a lot of people have been asking about it. And I know I promised a build video probably last week, but I just haven't had time to get to it. But, um, here it is, just basic four-piece tactician. With a Barrett's chest piece inventive backpack as well. Uh, what I've done, here I'll just go through every single one. Barrett's chest piece. I'll scroll down, pause the video if you need more time. I expect a lot of enemy armor damage and skill haste, skill power where it was able to be rolled into it. Knee pads. Everything has been fully optimized as well. Maybe not armor wise, but definitely attribute wise. So where we're sitting at now is 40% um, skill haste. And you'll notice that I also have rolled for uh, optimal damage to elites enemy armor damage where is able to be gotten um, without sacrificing um, skill power in that sense or skill haste so I'm still getting skill power on my backpack on my knee pads as well but I'm also getting damage to elites and enemy armor damage the trick to this build which uh, was I just thought about it. Uh, determined is just a hard skill to get on weapons at the 30 level. But if you craft a 204 weapon, they, I got a P416 here with Determined, Destructive, and Ferocious on it. Ferocious and Destructive are an absolute must for this build to help boost your enemy armor damage, damage to elites, which adds to that extra damage to NPCs. And then determined, of course, I've lost some skill haste in order to use my uh, damage to elite electronics mods, which may not be maxed out, but they're pretty close. Uh, electronics wise, I think they're 202, but 4% uh, damage to elites is the max you can get on purple mods. Um, so with that being said, uh, I'm losing... So 3, 6, 9, 12, 15% skill, no, not even that much. Let's look at my skill haste here. 40% skill haste. I'm losing 10% on the max, but I'm gaining 20% uh, more damage to elites due to these mods plus the 15 on the ferocious p416 so that allows my damage to elites to get up to the max which is 58 percent and my enemy armor damage with destructive on that same gun has been boosted up to 53 percent and that's the max for this build as well now everything everything has been rolled to electronics now I can get my electronics to uh, 10,000 with uh, normal electron uh, high-end electronics skill haste mods and I might be able to put two skill power mods in um, for extra skill power but you don't really need it so base right here is a hundred and one million four hundred forty four thousand um, damage and that's just base explosive damage now this is where the buffs come into play and this is 
Um, and once you get the 30 stack as well. Now, this gun may not do the most damage compared to its, uh, you know, 290 and above counterparts, but it's doing 10.6k. With the enemy armor damage and damage to elites, it, it gets higher than that. You'll, you'll definitely see a noticeable change. Um, or you won't really see a noticeable change when you're fighting actual NPCs. So this is why it's fine for uh, for doing this. But you will see that my skill power hat or my sticky bomb damage has gone up to 1.58 on that. But you don't even need you don't even need the uh, honestly you don't even need the skill power for that. I'm just gonna hit something so that my skills go away or the stack goes away. All right, cool. All right, so stack's gone away. I'm I've done the math already for you. So one, uh, one million four hundred forty-four thousand four hundred fifty-seven damage on the sticky bomb. All right, here's the math. If you want to do it with me, just check my math. You can, but I've already done it for you. Uh, fifty-eight percent of that damage comes out to eight hundred and thirty-seven thousand eight hundred and thirty-seven. It's weird that the numbers matched out, but hey, whatever. So that plus your base damage, and then also add in 53% enemy armor damage, is 7,000 or 765,000, excuse me, of uh, enemy armor damage as well. So that you can get in that by itself with no stacks for the tactician and without talented without death by proxy and without demolition expert you can get your sticky bomb doing three million forty seven thousand nine hundred with the current stacks that i have right now or current stats excuse me now if you get talented active on your gun i recommend having a predatory on this gun or on your secondary gun besides determined because you can use seeker minds and determined will activate um, after you kill them or you kill an enemy with your gun what not what have you um, you'll get your skills back really quick I, I found out that I can uh, pop my my signature health and get it back so fast with determined I can get it back in like two and a half minutes roughly if I'm continuously killing on PCs but definitely predatory is definitely a must in the third slot on your second gun uh, killing a target regenerates 35 percent of your health and that definitely applies so you can send out your seeker mines with your p416 or whatever 204 weapon you have and your seeker mines are gonna have that extra damage to elites enemy armor damage <clears throat> and then you can immediately switch to your gun with predatory and then once the bleed takes effect and finally kills them it'll activate the predatory for you so it constantly heals you so it's easier for you to use the inventive skill on your backpack now with I haven't gotten everything completely lined up the stars haven't aligned for me to use death by proxy which is uh, skill power is increased by 20% for 30 seconds after uh, you kill a deployed skill. So that's why Seekers are so amazing. Um, I haven't had the stars align. We're killing somebody with that. Having 30 stacks at the same time. Talented active on my gun. And hit two enemies with my sticky bomb all at the same time. If I have, I've known I've hit three and a half million at one point with my Seeker Mine. Or not Seeker Mine, my sticky bomb. Excuse me. This is a sticky bomb build. But it is a lot of fun. That's my build. It's based around enemy armor damage, damage to elites. You get the stacks. You get uh, extra health from uh, from damage to elites. You get extra health from predatory. Excuse me. Um, and it'll constantly heal you, allowing you to use uh, Allowing you to have the nomad, or not, god damn, I cannot talk today. Excuse me, the uh, inventive backpack, allow that you to use that. I was doing a nomad build earlier today, so. 
Um, but there you have it. It's it's a lot of fun to play. I mean, you're going to be squishy, but with that predatory activate, when that predatory activates, you can have uh, a lot of fun. You don't have to rely on a healer to maintain your full health. But all right, we'll go to the character sheet again. Weapon damage is kind of low, but like I said, with damage to elites and enemy armor damage, you don't really notice that much of a difference. It's all stacked into damage to elites. Hang on, I got the wrong gun equipped. There we go. 58%, 53% damage, uh, enemy armor damage. Skill power and skill haste is 40%. But with determined, you don't notice a change from the 50. But that's my build. I hope you enjoy some of this gameplay that I'm about to give you. I'm going to bounce over to Amherst. And, uh, and I hope you enjoy. A lot of these pesky medics and these legendaries can be a problem. Not with the 3 million sticky bomb. Boom. Gone. That was no stacks. Enemy armor damage. Hit him. Uh, it was 2.7 million that time. But uh, it can easily get higher than that. I know enemy armor damage and damage to elites kind of randomizes when it hits people. But like I said, send out those seeker mines while your, peop uh, while your enemy armor damage gun is out and immediately switch to your gun with predatory on it and you will be able to get uh, some some health back if you kill them with your seekers I'm just gonna drop my seekers here again see so yeah, I'm not at full health not necessarily need it with the damage to elites but that predatory immediately heals me back up so I can go ahead and use that uh, get some stacks here real quick ooh come on predatory heal me up bro everybody knows tacticians are squishy look at that enemy armor damage going out got health on kill as well I believe I have 10% look at that full health bye Missy you're dead 2.5 million. It's easily, easily gets up to 3 million. I, as you can see, I have no, uh, I don't have full stacks. I'm getting shot at. I'm constantly healing with predatory. As long as you play it correctly, it's a lot of fun and just, it's even more satisfying just watching enemies just get obliterated. But anyway, that's my build. I hope you like it. Don't, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Turn on uh, notifications so you can see when I'm streaming. I stream. I try to stream every other day. And uh, yeah, that's it. Bye, miss you.